reverse osmosis for IMPAC USA. Uh, this unit, as you see, is uh, equipped with all the pre-treatment necessary to deal with well water, brackish water. Um, there's multiple stages here I'd like to talk about. It starts with the first thing, with a little spin filter. That little spin filter uh, will remove all suspended solids greater than 50 micron. From there, uh, it will go to the ion exchange. The ion exchange system will remove hardness by exchanging ions of calcium, magnesium, lead and iron to ions of sodium, which will be removed at a later stage. From there, the water is going to go into the multimedia filter. The multimedia will remove any chlorine, any chemicals, will absorb bacteria, improve this other clarity of water. And from there, it's going to go to the sediment filters. We've got a 20 and a 5 micron sediment filters in series to eliminate as much as possible some suspended solids up to 5 micron. From there, the water is going to go to the reverse osmosis membrane uh, pump. I'm sorry, uh, that pump will raise the pressure to 225 psi, and from there, it's going to go to the membrane element. The membrane element is what will remove all dissolved solids, uh, and by then, the water is pure drinking water. Um, you have a complete panel here uh, that controls the whole system. There's a permeate flow meter, there's a drain flow meter to show you how much you're producing versus how much you're wasting. There is also a gauge after each phase, so in case of any clogging, you can pinpoint the service problem just by looking at the gauges. And there is two valves, one to control the system pressure and the other one to recirculate half of the concentrate wastewater back into the system again. Uh, you also have a complete panel. This panel has a little PLC system. The PLC system will, uh, uh, you can see the water quality, the conductivity the temperature and the, uh, and the hours of operation of the system. It also has indicator lights so that you would know if the, the, the pumps are running, if it's in flash or if it's on standby, just looking at it. And it has a bypass switch for the pump as well. Uh, I'm going to put the system to run so you get, gentlemen, you can see it, how it runs. Just once, one push of a button.